Hey everyone, welcome back. I hope you guys are all doing well. So today I am doing this get ready with me video where I am doing my go-to makeup look. Now this is something that I have been wearing a lot lately and if you guys follow me on my Snapchat or Instagram then you must have seen this look come up a lot. Um, it's this very simple everyday um, neutral look. I hope you guys enjoy getting ready with me and let's get started. So I always start off with primer if I have a long day ahead of me so I am using this Clinique one it's called their super primer really like this very lightweight and makes the foundation go on super easily for foundation I always reach forward to this one which is from body shop you guys have seen it so many times now I'm sorry but I really, really like this foundation for every day. And thank you so much all of you who commented about my YBP sponge um, in my 2016 makeup favorites. Thank you so much and I am so sorry I forgot to mention this in that video. Um, actually, this is really dirty so I am going to use the white one today. This one's good for someone with sensitive skin and somebody with acne. Uh, so the black one or any other colored one has a lot of dye um, gone into it like when they make it but the white one is pure. I have been saving this for the longest time and I am feeling really sad to use this. But here it goes. Oh, it's so pretty in white. Ah. So I am just dabbing the sponge all over my face to blend the foundation. I absolutely love the finish of this foundation. It is super easy to blend, has this beautiful dewy finish and it just works very well with sponge, brush, anything. Then I'm taking in this Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. It's completely over. I have used this one so much. I'm not going to apply too much. Just taking it underneath my eyes and on top of any blemishes that I have. And then just taking the sponge again and blending it all in. Moving on to eyebrows, I am using the Benefit Goof Proof Eyebrow Pencil. Uh, this is in the shade number 6. So I don't know if you've noticed, I haven't done my eyebrows in the longest time and I'm thinking of letting them be like I'm thinking of not doing my eyebrows ever again like I want to go back to my original eyebrow like what I had before I started threading just to see what the growth is like and then probably once it's like completely dense say after like five six months I am then going to go ahead and thread any of the extras in any shape that I have or probably I might not even thread it so I don't know we'll see we'll see but for now I am not touching my eyebrows at all for eyes I have been loving wearing like really bold winged eyeliner and I just applied this very simple eyeshadow underneath I have been using this BB26 from PAC non-stop it almost has a dent so I'm just picking up a little bit of this in my back 289 brush I love this brush and then I'm just patting it all over my eyes these eyeshadows are insanely pigmented I love them and then I'm going to take this shade it's a very warm matte brown and this is from my Xena eyeshadow palette just going to take a little bit onto a blending brush and then I'm going to apply this onto my crease. And I'm also applying it onto my lower lashes. That's it for eyeshadow. Now I'm going to apply eyeliner. I have been using the Nykaa 24 hour Vinyl Luxe Eyeliner a lot. So all of the pictures that you've been seeing on my Snapchat and on my Instagram with my bold winged liner, it's always been this one. That's 
that's it hopefully I get the same on the other eye that's it I usually hold my breath when I'm doing my eyeliner and hopefully they've come even I have done it quite thicker than usual and I've been loving thick winged eyeliner just realized I forgot to powder my face so I'm just going to use this one from Maybelline I think this is their super fresh just going to apply that all over my face For mascara, I am going to use the Lash Sensation one from Maybelline. I realized how much I used to love this mascara. It is so good. For those of you who met me at the meet and greet at the Lacme uh, Fashion Week the other day, so many of you said such nice things about my eyelashes, so thank you so much. This is the mascara that I was wearing. I am done with the eyes. I love this mascara so much. It just changes the entire eye look. Now to contour my face, I'm going to use this Lacme Moon Lit Highlighter. For blush, I'm taking this Rimmel one. It's called Coral. I'm just going to blend everything using the sponge. It's going to take off any excess. Then I'm going to use the highlighter from the same palette. I'm just going to take the like the cleaner side of the sponge. Just press the highlighter in. Now for lipstick, ever since Sonal gifted this to me, I have been wearing it non-stop. It's Dolce K uh, from the Kylie Cosmetics Lip Kit. So that's it for my face. This is a beautiful nude. It looks very nice in pictures. Um, dries very quickly. It also came with a lip liner that I always forget to use. And this is what the finished look is. You must have seen this so many times on my Snapchat. And so many of you requested that I do a tutorial on how I like to do this. So here it is. And I also actually have some probable dupes. They're not literally the same color as Dolce. Uh, but they are kind of like those cool toned nude the first one is 481 from Shambor uh, the second one is from back this is their number 07 this one is slightly darker and the Shambor one is slightly pinkier and then lastly Sandstorm from the liquid uh, suede range from NYX this one is lighter than Dolce K but it almost looks very similar it's very cool toned so these three could be like probably dupes for this and now for my hair I need dry shampoo so I'm just going to spray some so yeah that's it this is the finished look thank you so much for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this and let me know what is your go-to look for the day or whenever you're going out or when you want to look a little glam but you don't want to put too much effort I think this is my look for those kind of days and yeah that's it please subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already and I'll see you in my next video bye